So hi guys, this is Barsha, and you're watching Mastermind. So friends, in this session we are going to solve IEC Class 11 Mathematics Trigonometrical Functions. This that is your Chapter 4, and this is from your OP Malhotra book, that is your S Chand books. So let us begin. So friends, all these questions which I am going to solve, that is from your first exercise of your Chapter 4, that is Exercise 4A. And for this exercise, the formulas that you have to remember is the simple one which you have also done in your class 10 that is sin square theta plus cos square theta equals to 1 and this is theta and 1 plus tan square theta equals to sec square theta. So the first question in this you have to prove that LHS equals to RHS. So the first question 1 minus cos square theta you have to prove by solving this that LHS equals to RHS that is your sin square theta. We know that sin square theta plus cos square theta equals to 1. So, 1 can be written as sin square theta plus cos square theta. So, it will be sin square theta plus cos square theta and minus cos square theta is already there. So, now we can cut this plus cos square theta minus cos square theta. So, you are left with sin square theta that is your RHS. So, it is proved. Now, the next question root over 1 minus sin square theta. You have to prove this uh, prove by solving this that it is equal to RHS that is your cos theta. So, we know that sin square theta plus cos square theta equals to 1. So, so here cos square theta can be written as 1 minus sin square theta. Cos square theta can be written as 1 minus sin square theta. And since here is square, so when it will go that side, it will become root. So, it will be cos theta equals to root over 1 minus sin square theta. So, instead of 1 minus sin square theta, we can write cos square theta. So, this thing actually I wrote here. You need to write it over here. So, it is equal to cos theta equals to RHS. So, you have to write this part here. You have to solve this here. So, this was your RHS. LHS equals to RHS. Now, the next question, question number 3. You have to prove that sec alpha root over 1 minus sin square alpha is equal to RHS that is your 1. So, sec alpha and this is root over 1 minus sin square theta. We have already done this. It is cos theta. So, instead of this, we can write cos theta, sorry, cos alpha because it is alpha in the angle. Now, sec theta can be written as 1 by cos theta and cos theta is already there. So, this 2 is going to get cancelled and you are left with 1 which is equal to your RHS. So, it is proved. Now, the next question, question number 4. x square theta minus 1 divided by tan square theta equals to 1. You have to prove this. So, we know that 1 plus tan square theta is equal to sec square theta. So, instead of tan square theta, we can write sec square theta minus 1. Sec square theta is here. This will come here. So, it will be minus 1 and we are left with tan square theta. So, tan square theta is equal to sec square theta and this will go this side. It will be minus 1. So, instead of this, we can write tan square theta and divided by tan square theta. So, it will get cancelled and you are left with 1. So, it is equal to your RHS. So, now the next question, question number 5 sec square theta minus 1 minus tan square theta equals to 0. You have to prove this. So, for this sec square theta minus we can take common from here. So, if we, if we take common, so it will be minus and it will be 1 here inside the bracket and here will be plus. Minus into plus is minus. So, we are writing here plus 1 plus tan square theta. Now, sec square theta as it is we have written minus 1 plus tan square theta. It is sec square theta. Now, this 2 is going to get cancelled and it will, we are left with 0 which is equal to your RHS. Hence proved. Now, the next question, question number 6. You have to prove that sin square theta plus cos square theta divided by sec square theta minus tan square theta is equal to your RHS that is 1. So, for this we know the formula that sin square theta plus cos square theta equals to 1. Now, sec square theta can be written as 1 by cos square theta and tan square theta can be written as sin square theta by cos square theta. So, 1 by, now we have to take the LCM, LCM, so it will be cos square theta and now we are left with 1 minus sin square theta. Now, this will go up and this will, this will go up and this will come down. So, it will be cos square theta by 1 minus sin square theta. Now, we know that cos square theta and 1 minus sin square theta, we know that it is cos square theta. You all know this. So, this will get cancelled and we are left with 1. So, this which is equal to your RHS. Hence proved. 
वेल नाउ द नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर सेवन वन माइनस कॉस स्क्वेर थीटा माइनस साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा इज इक्वल टू जीरो यू हैव टू प्रूव दिस सो वी नो दैट वन कैन बी रिटर्न एज साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा प्लस कॉस स्क्वेयर थीटा बिकॉज साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा प्लस कॉस स्क्वेयर थीटा इज इक्वल टू वन एंड वी आर राइटिंग एज इट इज कॉस स्क्वेयर थीटा माइनस साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा नाउ इट कैन गेट कैंसिल दिस वन एंड दिस वन प्लस साइंस प्लस साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा एंड माइनस साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा कैन गेट कैंसिल एंड प्लस कॉस स्क्वेयर थीटा माइनस कॉस स्क्वेयर थीटा सो यू आर लेफ्ट विथ जीरो विच इज इक्वल टू योर आर एच एस नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन नंबर एट यू हैव टू प्रूव दैट साइन टू द पार फोर थीटा प्लस साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा इन टू कॉ स्क्वेयर थीटा इज इक्वल टू साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा सो फॉर दिस वी कैन राइट साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा होल स्क्वेयर सो दिस इज गोइंग टू बी वी कैन राइट दिस इंस्टेड ऑफ दिस इंस्टेड ऑफ दिस वी कैन राइट साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा होल स्क्वेयर प्लस साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा इन टू कॉ स्क्वेयर थीटा नाउ नाउ वी कैन टेक साइन स्क्वेयर थीटा कॉमन from here so it will be sin square theta and there are two sin square theta so it will be sin square theta plus sin square theta is already out so we are left with cos square theta now we know that sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 so it will be sin square theta which is equal to your rhs so this is also proved Now the next question, question number nine. You have to prove that sine to the power four theta plus two sine square theta into cos square theta plus cos to the power four theta is equal to one. So we are going to write this one as the previous one. So it is going to be sine square theta whole square. It is going to be sine four theta plus two sine square theta into cos square theta. And this also we can write it in this way. So it will be cos square theta whole square. Now we. can see that this is in the formula a plus b whole square it is a square plus 2 ab plus b square so we can write this as a plus b whole square so a plus b that is sin theta plus cos square theta sin square theta plus cos square theta whole square a plus b whole square so sin we know the formula that sin square theta plus cos square theta is equal to 1 1 square so 1 square will be equal to 1 which is equal to your rhs so this is also solved So now the next question, question number ten. You have to prove that cos square theta into cos square cos x square theta minus cot square theta is equal to cos square theta. So for this, we can write cos square theta, and this cos x square theta can be written as one by sine square theta because they are reciprocal of each other, cos uh, sine and cos x, and cot square theta can be written as sine uh, sorry cos square theta by sine square theta. now we can take the lcm of this one so it will be sin square theta 1 minus cos square theta now cos square theta and we know that 1 minus cos square theta can be written as sin square theta divided by sin square theta again so this is going to get cancelled and we are left with cos square theta so which is equal to your rhs friends in this video i have solved till question number 10 and the rest of the questions i am going to solve in my next video because the video is going to be too lengthy so friends this was the video thanks for watching this video and if you like this video then please do give the thumbs up button and subscribe our channel mastermind and yes if you have any doubts or queries then you can write to us in the comment section thank you